Hey guys, it's Bella and welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I have my February kit lineup, which I know this is going up super late because we basically start March tomorrow. But um, yes, I think I'm just always going to be a little bit behind in my planner and that's okay. And I think that'll also help me not to feel overwhelmed. Um, and yeah, like I'm comfortably behind without being, you know, six months behind like I was last year in my planner, but um, yeah. So anyways, here is my February lineup. So starting off with my February monthly. So I do have the February monthly sort of sampler that I purchased from Planner Fixico. There are a few different font options. So I'm not really sure what this font is, but um, I do have this one in uh, Lavender Hollow for February. So here is that, which I'm really excited. I did really love how the January um, monthly turned out with the Blue Hollow. So I just think this is going to look really nice. And then for the monthly kit, I'm sticking with Caress Press. So I do have the Like a Rose monthly because I wanted to use this art, but I did also want to use a different kit for Valentine's. So I just thought best way to have both art sets in my planner. So I did get the um, Deco sidebar with just the like little desk, like the coffee table and the um, like couch in the background. And then here is the kit. So we do have the... Um, Decorative boxes, the deco and um, date dots. Sorry for the glare. The sun is full force right now. And then we have the um, top bars and days to cover the days not in the month. Strips to cover the days not in the month. Um, the payday flags and labels, the other top bar and decorative um, boxes, like pattern boxes and labels. And then the other labels page and the icon. So cannot wait to lay this down. Um, I'm going to try and not do the base for this off camera, so I'll try to do it on camera this time, um, but we'll see how we go. And then next we go into all of the weekly spreads. So for the week that was the 29th of January to the 4th of February, I'm using this kit from Sadie's Stickers. Um, I have been hoarding this for a little while because I did buy this last year. I believe this was in the haul that I um, never got around to uploading. So. Yes, but um, I did get the deco sheet. So this is the Waves kit. I don't know if this is still available in shop. It might be because she tends to keep her kits for quite a while. Um, and this is now in an older format because the kits, the new kits are in a different format now. But um, yeah, so here is the floral add-on um, sheet with the deco. And then here is the kits. So we have the full boxes and this is in like a champagne gold, I believe, like a light gold. See, so these other full boxes, really nice, sort of like summer beachy theme. Um, so there's that. And then we have the like boxes page, the headers and like sidebar. So this has changed. Like there's no longer like the checklists and things um, or the habit trackers, I think, or like this kind of stuff. I think some of this has changed in the new format, but this is an older format. Um, some layering shapes and some like torn strips. And then the bottom washi and date covers and some um, deco and some scallops and things as well. So. That is for the first week, which was the end of January, beginning of February. Then for the next week, which was the 5th to the 11th, I am using a Lunar New Year kit because that was the week that Lunar New Year um, began, I guess. So here is the kit. This is a Lunar New Year kit from Crest Press. So I did get the 15mm add-on. This is the Essentials Format in Premium Matte. Um, so we have the full boxes, the labels page in the solids and patterns, glitter headers, um, functionals, and whatnot, which again, this is an older format um, because Maggie has since reformatted the kits slightly, but that is that. And then to go with it, I did get the Lunar New Year bundle in uh, sparkly champagne gold or champagne lights, I guess. Um, so here is that. I did get the mini bundle. So you do get the um, overlays for your full boxes and headers. And there's also a tall box, um, the bottom washi and date covers, hole protectors and whatnot. And then the scripts and icons. And then if you get the full, you get the underlays. But I, like I said, got the mini. Um, so that will be for Lunar New Year week. And then for va Valentine's, so the week of the 12th to the 18th, I am using... Uh, Pillow Talk from Whimsical Plans. So 
here is that kit. Um, this is my first time using this shop, so I'm very excited to try this out. This is the smaller uh, of the two kits that she has. So she's got a small and like an ultimate. Um, and then I just get an add-on as well. So here is the kit. I really love this art. This is Sadie Piper art, which I didn't get to use last year. So I decided um, as soon as I saw the recolor um, announced, I was like, okay, I need to get a kit with this art. And there was a few shops, but I just thought I would try out Whimsical Plans because I have been meaning to try out this shop for a while. So here is the kit. This is in glossy paper as well. Um, so we've got the full boxes, deco, and sort of like layering and functionals. Um, functionals pays with some more boxes. Sorry if you can hear screaming. The neighbors are out and about. Um, so yes. Um, anyways, and then labels page, more labels and glitter headers. And then the bottom washi and extra box. And then this was the add-on, which had some more labels and the fashion girls. So that is the kit. And then to go with it um, was a bit of a wild card um, foil, but this is the Valentine's bundle in coral from Kristen's planner. Um, so yes, I wanted to sort of try and pull in more of this orange, which I didn't get it perfectly in terms of color match, but I think this will do. So I'm just gonna give it a go. I was considering using some solid underlays that I received as part of my order like in a um oops bundle but I just think it's going to be too much and um I don't know I don't think I'm ready for that step yet so I'm just going to stick with what my original intention was which is um the bundle so here's the bundle here so we've got uh two pages of overlays and headers which are really cute I'm gonna to have to work out like which ones I want to put the scripts on so there is that and then we do get two pages of underlays but I will only use one and then we do get scripts and a uh, toolbox as well. And then we do get the bottom washi and um, like date covers and things. So that is that. Um, we'll be very interested to see what that looks like all laid down. Cause like I said, I did sort of miss the mark with the foil color, but um, I did the best that I could because, you know, I do rely on like um, the photos and things online because I don't have foil samples for the foil shops that I purchased from. So something to consider maybe, but anyways, and then for the final full week in February, so the 19th to the 25th, um, I have this kit from, Cre oh, from Crespus. I have this kit from Scribble Prince Co, which is ice cream shop, which was um, a mystery kit that has been reformatted. So I bought this in shop. Um, so it did come with a toolbox, which is really cute. I may try and find a way to use this in my spread. And then here is the kit, which this is my first time using an ultimate kit from Scribble Prince Co, which I mentioned in the Black Friday haul. But the reason I got the ultimate was because by the time I went to purchase on um, the kit, uh, the add-ons and things that I normally would have bought were no longer available. So I just thought I would make things easier for myself by picking up the ultimate. So we've got the full boxes, deco and sort of sidebar, glitter headers and some more extra boxes. And then we have this page, which I've never used, with all the, like the rounded boxes and like layering elements, little things, uh, patterned boxes and solids, which I really love these colors. And then we have the bottom washi and date covers. So yes, and then to go with this, I have the ice cream bundle from Planaha in Pixie Hollow. So really love this. I was kind of like tossing up between using gold or hollow because I know a few people I've seen use this, use this kit have used gold but I just thought I don't know with all the blues I just thought hollow would look better so that's why I picked this up in hollow so yes pixie hollow because I wanted to add some sparkles we've got the headers and icons scripts and date dots and like corners and things the bottom washi and um yeah bottom washi flags and like the extra full box there then this has the confetti overlays and then the ice cream underlays so again i'll probably just use one set of the underlays because i am still um not really into that look like i like to use one set so then i can have a little bit of it without it overwhelming my spread so uh yes i forgot what i was going to say i was going to say something don't remember what i was going to say um but yes so oh yes um so then the next week which was the like 26th of Feb to the 3rd of March will be in my March haul just because not my March haul my March kit lineup sorry I'm like my brain is fried I have just filmed my um haul so like yeah I've talked way too much today and my brain is suffering but anyways um what I was going to say is uh in terms of videos like plan with me's 
I'm thinking of possibly filming three this month. I was only going to do two for Lunar New Year week and for um, Valentine's, but I did actually have a very exciting week last week. So, um, yes, I may film the ice cream kit spread. And then the only one that I won't film would be the first week, which was pretty uneventful. So I'm just going to try and like get everything into frame as best as I can so that I can get a thumbnail. I'm just going to move everything off my desk so that I can sort of get this as evenly distributed as I can. Um, but yeah, that is my February kit lineup. Let me know if you used any of these these kits. I know quite a few people used the um, Lunar Nia art, um, and I'm sure some people would have used the Pillow Talk art this year as well. So let me know if we are twinning in any weeks um, or any foil options. And yeah, I will see you in my next video, which will be my haul. Um, so that's already filmed, ready to go. And then, like I said, I will also see you in my spreads for February, which will probably be for these um, three weeks. And then obviously my February monthly as well. So yeah, that is it for this video. All the shops will be listed down below as always. And I will see you in my next one. Give this a thumbs up and subscribe, comment down below. Um, and yeah, bye guys.